2, then let's go over to the other action bars so you can see what's going on with those. So for instance, we've got Control 1 as our Stealth, Control 2 as Vanish. So we've got a, uh, Control 3 as Shadow Meld, because uh, I'm a Night Elf, and then Blind. So I've got all my visibility things all tacked in right here on the Control bar. Control 1 may disappear. Control 2 may disappear in combat. Control 3 may disappear when everything's gone bupkis. Control 4 may disappear because you can't see me. Well, okay. You can't see me. Everyone else still can. Now, below this, I have um, some weapon macros. Um, this is a macro. Let me pull this up. And these are just... I've got these across all my classes, all my abilities, but... Okay, basically just shows me what weapons I'm carrying in each hand. So use 16, use 17. Now the nice thing with this is it means that I've got my abilities sitting with my whatever I'm currently carrying sitting there. Lucky fishing pole and nothing in my offhand now. But it's useful if you've already got the weapons on because you can do this. Now uh, you remember I showed you Opi earlier. Control 6 down here sitting next to my weapons is my poisons ring. So I can go, hey, give me, that's a useless one, uh, deadly poison four, and put it on my axe. I know, you can probably write macros that simplify that out. This is, for me, this is all based on how can I use my on-screen menus so I don't have to remember and don't have to program macros for everything. Um, these are all my instant call abilities. Now these again are macros. Uh, these two here, Lufa and Philosopher's Stone are macros that are calling up... Where are you? Uh, trinket. No, that's Trick. Trinket 1 and Trinket 2. And all they do, again, is just like the weapons one, they go and they say, use um, show tooltip for the item, and then use 13 or use 14. And so that way, if I do swap out trinkets, they're still showing there, but I have them as abilities and items that I can use. And you'll see they've got a green border around them because they're currently equipped. Lifeblood, because I'm an herbalist. I like the herbs. Okay, well, Grandos likes the herbs. Uh, personally, I don't smoke, but, you know. Okay, got to have the healing potion. Always helpful. My moist toilet. Useless after level 60, whatever. And again, your thistle tea. Doesn't use mana, uses energy. So instead of having a mana thing here, I've got my thistle tea. So I can instantly, in the middle of combat, go Alt minus here, Alt B05, and get myself some health, or Alt B0, B10, and get myself some energy. Um, clean off a bleed effect. Clean off a uh, spell effect. It doesn't really do anything. It's just a nice um, buff. I don't Sometimes the trinkets aren't that helpful. Okay, so that's, so we've got main one, shift with all of our finishing moves, control with all of our uh, extraneous abilities, hmm. eh. alt with all of our consumables, in-game active consumables, so we come back over to control shift. Now I've already gone over this a bit in uh, the base game, in, in the generic uh, interface changes, but I'm going to cover it over here anyway. And what we have now is the usual. Um, let's see, I'm going to pull these up with the N52. Uh, we've got our rings. We've got our mounts. We've got our pets. And if anyone can help me with this, for some reason I'm running Win 7 now and all of a sudden Control Shift 0 as a binding does not work. I am currently pressing it right now and Control Shift 0 is doing nothing. Control Shift equals fine. Control Shift 0, squat. I can't even bind to it. I had to do it on Windows XP. So, um, if anyone knows why Control Shift Zero doesn't work in Win 7 and WoW, well, give me a holler so I can fix it. Because currently I can't call it up with the N52. So it's a good thing it's just my pets. Um, okay, so here's one. Control Shift 3. Uh, buffs. Which, in this case, includes my poisons. Battle potions, guard potions, flasks, um, scrolls, and some other stuff in here. Um, not showing currently. Oh, and the paging. Okay, so the paging is, remember we showed you there's these three bars are going to change. Again, uh, alt up for page one, alt down for page two, which brings us to the crafting opi. 
menu, alchemy, all the good stuff in here. Um, pick locks fishing. Um, again, I've got those macros thrown in here so that you can see my weapons. Probably don't do that. Along with some items that I like to be able to switch to easily. Go away. Um, and that's kind of redundant. Okay, thank you. Um, hmm. Anyway, so there's some layouts there. Okay, my next video. Um, kind of be in action doing some stuff uh, with Grendelsh, and uh, you can see it in action. See you then.